What's up guys? Jay and Nikki from Unfiltered Fishing. Gonna do a little trout challenge. <laughs> 1v1, girlfriend versus boyfriend. What does the loser do? Um, what does the winner get? The winner gets a Van Soul. The winner for a <laughs> trout challenge? Well, I just want more Van Soul. Sounds, I need one uh, in every uh, size. You have one in every size. No, I don't. Know. I don't have a 150. The 150 is coming soon. I don't know. That's the first thing that pops into my head. All right. Well, the, the, uh, the loser does something. We'll determine later, I guess. <laughs> you got to wear the clown nose for the whole next video. Okay. Well, that's easy for you. <laughs> it is. You'll enjoy doing that. <laughs> Catch you guys out there. <laughs> I'm not sure. There's one. <laughs> Nicole! They're little rainbows. Ooh. <laughs> I'm not going to get that release. <laughs> oh, well, we tried to get the release that on one. this camera. <laughs> oh, pop those. I should just keep that on. So I can just stick it in the water. Yeah. <laughs> well, we found some fish. Little rainbows. They're not big enough for a catching cook, though. We gotta find some browns. Yeah, a little chop magnet on there. That's a nice one. Oh, I dropped them. Huh? Yeah. That was a nice brown. That was a really nice brown. I can't believe he fell off. Did you? Oh, oh, he dropped it. That's two. I'll count that one.
My cat Basil here is Nicole Strout. He's about 14 and a half inches long and almost two pounds. It's about two pounds. So I already bled this fish out. What I'm gonna do is show you how to clean it while keeping it home. First thing we're gonna do is take a uh, sharp fillet knife and just cut up from the anal vent. Straight up the middle of the fish. What you want to do is you want to break this membrane on the inside. If you can see there's a lot of black and gunk inside there, you want to cut that open and rinse out all of that blood. Get some cold water here. Next thing we're going to do is scale it. So moving the opposite way of the head, just use the flat end of the knife. Huh? You could scale it first, yes. Try to have very small scales. You can please be gone in track. Okay everybody, welcome back to the, to the uh, cook part. And there is Nicole Strout. She wins the day, she definitely got the bigger fish. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna score the score the skin. both sides of the fish. Not the best knife. I'm gonna put the fish in, in here. I already uh, pre-buttered it. I'm gonna put some butter inside the body cavity. What are you putting on there? Putting some lemon pepper on here. I get to it. Probably should have did that before I put the butter on. Let me get it inside the body cavity. <laughs> it's such a disaster. It'll be fine. It'll be delicious. Can you salt it? Pretty liberally. Some salt on the inside, which probably would have been smart to do. After you just fixed your butter for the second <laughs> time. Just fixed my butter. <laughs> train wreck. It is a train wreck right now. No, you're a train wreck. <laughs> <laughs> this whole video is going to be a train wreck. But that's okay. Because it's, it's good. 
Uh, so I did that. I'm going to put a little garlic powder. Again, really should have did this before. Because now the butter's messed up again, but it's okay. Put some fresh dill. Put more of it inside the body cavity. They already got the oven, oven preheated to 350 degrees. And he's going to go in. Okay, so I don't know why I thought it was going to take 10 minutes for an entire fish to cook. That if it was fillets, it would be different. But I guess. It probably took about, <laughs> it took about, what, about 40 minutes in the oven. But there it is. It's all done. Uh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try a piece. Oh, and he also forgot to put the lemon on. Yes, I forgot to put the lemon on the top, which I added afterwards. After I closed the oven, I opened it back up and put it in. It's pretty good. It's actually really good. Enjoy my fish. So there's nothing wrong with eating stock trout from Long Island. They come from a hatchery. Delicious. Well, guys, that's it. I'm going to wrap it up here. Um, thanks for watching. If you like the video and you want to see more videos just like this with me and Nicole fishing and catching cooks and challenges, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Um, all the gear that we use will be linked down in the video below, and you guys can, uh, can go back and watch it. Elsa, what are you doing over there? Elsa said, <laughs> I want some fish. She does. Look at that tag, Whalen. <laughs> Give her a piece of fish. Let's see if Elsa when approves. It cools down, I give her a piece of fish. Does Elsa approve of the fish? It's kind of hot. What do you think, Elsa? I'll put it in my bowl. Elsa, look, he's going to give you a fish. Do you approve? Elsa. Come on, Elsa. Go ahead. Is it Elsa approved? That would yeah, be a I yes. I would say yes. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks a lot. Nicole, you got anything to say? No, not right now. <laughs>